Millions of Americans and more than 17% of all Hoosiers are now fully vaccinated against COVID-19. And those numbers are rapidly increasing ahead of a holiday weekend and spring break for many. The CDC is offering new recommendations for air travel. WRTV's Cornelia Soccer dives into the latest changes and the impact they're having on travelers. People are passing through the Indianapolis airport for a lot of different reasons. It's our senior spring break. I'm actually just relocated to Indiana. And these travelers, if they're fully vaccinated, can feel more at ease about where they're going after new guidelines from the CDC were announced Friday saying those who are fully vaccinated can travel within the U.S. and do not need COVID-19 testing or to quarantine once they reach their destination as long as they're taking COVID-19 precautions. We're going to continue to keep all the great practices in place washing our hands, staying our distances and things of that sort. Viviana Menzies tells me these new CDC recommendations make sense and will make traveling for her easier than it has been this last year. Very excited to be have this, you know, be fully vaccinated and have, can get back on the road and get on the, you know, be able to travel and fly not only for work, but um, with peace for, you know, fun. Speaking of fun, Trey Davis and his friends are heading to Florida for spring break. He says they need it after the school year they've had. Oh, it's been terrible. Having to wear masks and like be at home, that's just sucked. At 18, he just became eligible to get vaccinated and he says he will because he sees the benefit of traveling without worrying about the virus. He tells us what he hopes life is like in the coming months as more Americans get fully vaccinated. In like six or seven months, I just can't wait to not wear these masks and just be able to be with people that with, without masks and just be in a place where we can all just hang out. Working for you, Cornelius Hawker, WRTV.